Now you can't see the rainbow because the path that I'm walking on is actually wet because it was raining, so the light wouldn't re reflect well. So let me see if I can get a good spot where it's reflecting well. Other than that, I can see it, but the camera can't. So I'm guessing we get into a good spot right now. There we go. Coming clear. It's almost like I'm walking around with a projector. As you can see, the build is finally complete. So I started off by making a foam box. After that, I added a 12 volt LED bulb to the foam box. Then I hot glued a light prism to one end of the box. Then I covered 
the areas where light was leaking out. So on the light prism, I added some electrical tape because white light was actually leaking out. So this tiny little piece of the light prism is what's going to show the rainbow. The rest of the light prism is just leaking out white light. So I covered up all those areas out using electrical tape. So because this is a car bulb, I can easily just turn it and remove it. As you can see, these are the LEDs. So to put it back, I just have to find the right face that I need. And then I just put it in like that, turn it and it's back in place. So the car LED bulb is connected to a switch as you can see this is low beam and high beam low beam doesn't actually do anything high beam is what does everything because the face that's facing the light prism is actually the high beam side I can just if I want I can actually use the low beam LEDs I just have to turn it to the low beam side and then just put it in and turn it so right now I'm just using the high beam because high beam is way brighter than low beam. So the car LED bulb is connected to a switch and then the switch is connected to 11.1 lithium polymer battery. And that's all you will need. You just need a battery, a switch, an LED bulb, a box and a light prism. And then you got yourself a rainbow, a rainbow that you can create anytime you want. Just by a click of a switch, you got yourself a rainbow. So as you can see, this is low beam. It doesn't actually do anything. Then this is high beam, like that. Now, let me demonstrate to you the power of the artificial rainbow. Okay, so this is low beam. As you can see, this is the white light. Pretty cool, right? Now, this is the magic. This is the rainbow that you have been waiting for. Boom. Well, it's super bright. Let me try to dim it down a bit. There we go. Would you look at that? This rainbow, I can put it on any surface. This is just small. If I want to make it bigger, I just have to pull the box further away. Look at that. Just look at that. Isn't it beautiful? So the problem is the ca you have to dial down the brightness because it's just too bright. But I think it's beautiful. So this is low beam. This is low beam. As you can see, you can't see much. Then high beam is where the fun is. See? Okay, now let me see how big of a rainbow I can create. So I'm going to pull it back a bit. Okay, so this is further away. Look at that. Now I'm going to try to go even further. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? This is even further away. See? It's like a rainbow torch. can make it smaller, you can make it bigger, you just have to keep on going back and back and, and it just keeps on getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Thanks for watching, please consider liking or subscribing. Hope to see you in another video.